So just recently, Microsoft has launched a new app called the Windows app. This is the app which will bring many Windows features and services in one app, such as Windows 365 virtual desktops or cloud desktops, remote desktop, etc. And this app is now available for most of the major platforms, Windows, Mac OS, iOS, iPad, Android, this is also available in web browser but there is a problem with windows app and web browser which we will talk about as we go through this video okay so if you want to get more info about this app you can go here and uh, see what's up okay now i'm going to give you guys a demo so first of all i have downloaded this on uh, a android phone so this is the app logo and uh, this says Windows app open this up it will prompt you to sign in with Microsoft account if you have a work account or school account you can sign in but if you have a personal account that won't work but luckily in Android maybe or even in other platforms like Mac OS and iOS you can skip the sign-in process and use some of the features like the remote desktop so you can click on this plus icon at the top here you can add account and again only the work and school account will work personal accounts won't work and you can also add workspace and pc connection this option allows you to control your windows device from anywhere like from your phone so you can click on that and uh, put the host name or ip address here and then save and here you can see i have one pc already added here so let's click on that i'm gonna enter the user account and hit continue and here is our pc this is actually my laptop using this you can remotely control your pc now on windows you can download this app from microsoft store or you can also use it on web browser but if you only have a personal microsoft account you can't use this and I don't know why but you can't even skip this process unlike in Android app in Android app you don't have to sign in you can skip that process and you can still use the remote desktop but in here if you don't sign in I don't see a skip button or cancel button no nothing like that so you'll need a work or a school account to use this app on windows or web browser for now so you can go to this website from here you can find the download links for windows app for different platforms and you can also find a web browser link to use this app on your web browser but this will only work if you have a work or a school account if you have a personal microsoft account this will not work i don't know why okay <laughs> i don't know why but it works on android without signing in and yeah that's it for this one hope you enjoyed it but if you still have any questions or have any suggestions for me you can always do the comment and we can have some chit chat in the comment section too yeah that's it i'll see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun Bye bye